Mr. Srinivas Rao Saripalli, who is the founder man and managing director at Energy Way Technologies, will now come on stage and talk about how simple student tracking has become in schools and buses. Now, uh, I'm not an educationist, uh, and uh, uh, you're all educationists, and uh, I will only listen to you and learn a lot from you on education. Uh, but I'm a technologist, and uh, uh, I made it uh, my passion that, you know, one of the smallest uh, uh, things uh, which is of course a very big priority for all of us as a school management principals across cities, across India and across the world. Okay, this is one of the biggest priority and my attempt here today is to, you know, uh, in, uh, give you some kind of an information and uh, if I could uh, make you think about it and a uh, little bit and if you give it a priority, I think uh, half my job is done. And uh, I, we uh, at School Smart have engineered an awesome solution. And uh, we have got a lot of technologists which have got about 30, 40 years of uh, experience in R&D work. And we are from Bangalore. And sir, like uh, said, we have reached a state of known competence. And we want to reach a stage of unknown competence. So in technology and in student tracking. Uh, so what I'm talking about is uh, student uh, tracking, safety and assurance, uh, is it a priority? So many people talk about it, but ha you talk about education, artificial intelligence, your school buses, AC, curriculum, and all that. But do you, as a management and the principals, take it very seriously to change age-old bus tracking solutions, which is very normal, it's a bus. We put the student on top, while all the other bus tracking solutions are a subset of that. So I'm going to talk about that, and how we, uh, those solutions are uh, useful, and how they are made simple, and uh, we are the uh, designers uh, of the product, of the hardware, we make the application, and we give it as a service to the schools. And so when somebody joins us in our school smart movement, they just need not bother about this piece of it because we will take care of it. If it's working, it's us. If it is not working, it's us because we have got everything done in house. So, not uh, to waste any more time, I would just uh, take you through a little AV which gives a summarizing of the solution. So, and after that, I think we will. A safe child is of utmost importance for the bright future of any society. At School Smart, we understand this. That is why our easy to implement solution is designed, which provides complete safety to children as its primary purpose. To understand better, let's take a look at a day in Thara's life and how she is at ease with the help of School Smart, and so are Thara's parents. Every day before leaving to school, Thara's mother makes sure she wears her School Smart badge. Equipped with RFID sensors and monitored real time by School Smart managers, the School Smart badge tracks every step of Thara whether she is on the school bus, classroom, or even her school playground. And all the seven modules built around the School Smart badge only help to enable the safety of Thara in a more robust manner. Comprehensive en route surveillance tells her parents the location of her school bus, and the School Smart manager can even monitor what's happening inside the bus, thanks to the cameras installed in the buses. Thara's mother gets appropriate alerts on her mobile. Now that she has reached school safely, she enters the school campus, where SchoolSmart's Campus Solution Suite ensures absolute safety of Thara. There is no need for the teacher to take a roll call because that task has been assigned to SchoolSmart's automated attendance marking system and thus eliminating the outdated manual attendance registers. Now that it's lunchtime and Thara is playing with her best friends in the playground, School Smart Manager and also Teacher can monitor not just hers, but almost all students' movement with in-school zoning tool. Our Parent and Visitor Management System makes sure that only school-approved visitors can enter after going through a quick but thorough check on the purpose of visit. With school time over, Thara is now back on the school bus, en route to her home. Thara's parents know that she will reach home faster because of the route optimization tool that plans the easiest and hassle-free bus route for the bus driver to follow. But since her mother is out on a small job and cannot pick up Thara, she uploads the photo of Thara's uncle in School Smart's Smart Pickup Tool that authorizes him to pick her up. 
Thara reaches home safely and her mother gets alerts in her mobile that Thara has alighted and picked up by her uncle, giving her the much needed joy and peace of mind. Not just Thara, but children of schools across India are looking at SchoolSmart as a revolutionary child safety solution. Wear the SchoolSmart badge and join our community for safer children. Are you SchoolSmart safe? Think of child safety. Think of SchoolSmart. Okay, uh, now that you have uh, seen the AV and everything cannot be uh, showed in that two minute video, but uh, we have tried to do that. Now let me explain to you each of these uh, solutions briefly. So what we say when we have uh, the en route uh, surveillance, that means the moment the kid boards the bus, uh, till the time they reach the school and we have got, you know, you would know that when the kid has boarded, when the kid has reached school, where they have alighted and uh, all these kind of alerts are uh, given to the parents and we also have a mobile app where you can always uh, track all this. But not only that, uh, we also have something called a panic button inside the bus. If there is any uh, issue, somebody can press the panic button and then alerts can go to the SOS to the respective uh, administrators. And also there is a two-way communication which is enabled. So the driver can keep driving but he can talk by just by the administrator calling the bus because he need not have a phone or whatever it is. The thing, uh, the speaker automatically comes up. So you have a one-to-one -one conversation. We have got live tracking uh, sitting at the school and at desktop. Your person can log on to a particular route bus and see what's happening. So we have got uh, enhanced uh, cameras and uh, it's uh, thanks to uh, 4G and all that uh, if they are enabled and they are Wi-Fi so you can track all that. So what I mean to say is these are all things which can be done. But are we talking about only uh, 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 students who are tracking with the bus? No. What about students who don't track, come by their bus but they directly go to the school? So the moment you, we have got readers installed and all these readers let me tell you is that the kid just waits this card, this is an RFID card, there is no swiping, there is no cues, there is nothing, it becomes their identity card, that's it. So that's all they have to do. So we want to make it simple for the kids, you don't have to tell them that or put IRs in the past that they will try to swipe them etc etc. It is just that they wait and our uh, technology takes care. So, so, so we have uh, all this uh, light tracking. So once the student enters the school, you know when he has reached, when he has left the school. And going a step beyond that is the moment he reaches school, where should you have attendance? It's already taken. Uh, uh, he shouldn't reach school. So that's where our uh, automatic attendance comes. And we also have an app for the class teacher where uh, uh, even if you want, suppose for some reason the kid has forgotten his card, you have an option to just tick present and that goes into the server and that will become the attendance. So again, so, so what we are trying to do is we are trying to innovate in this particular area how, what else we can do and what all we can uh, uh, think of and implement and so that it's less hassle uh, free for the school and the uh, school administration and you will eliminate all this manual attendance and all that stuff. So, so and coming to that then we, when we do that we have got something called an in-school zoning where if there are vulnerable areas you want to track. Uh, for example, somebody, I was having a discussion uh, just today in the morning. Somebody said, can we, we want to know what's happening in the toilet. Obviously, you can't have a camera in the toilet. You can't have facial recognition in the toilet and etc. Et but RF readers can get into a toilet. Okay, at least you will know how much time if there is an alert, if somebody spent uh, more than five, ten minutes or if a boy tag has gone into a girl tag. Uh, 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 toilet or something, some kind of alerts can be done. So that's where we call it as in-school zoning. You identify your vulnerable areas, we can track uh, uh, where the student is at what point of time and etc. etc. And all this is for the administration. I'm not saying that this has to be passed down to the parents or you have the leverage whether what rights to give it to the parents and what rights the school has. We only deal with the school because uh, uh, we don't do anything uh, with the parents, without the information, the school says this is how you have to give the information, that's how we give. So we are, our, uh, entirely everything is with the school. Now again, uh, like uh, I said, uh, now uh, handing over of kids, like a familiar pay, face to pick up. Suppose somebody, you always have cards and the card somebody, anybody who gets the card, you might hand over the kid. No, we need not do that. Just by sitting at home, suppose if somebody doesn't go, you can from the mobile phone upload the photo, it gets updated in the security uh, uh, guys tab 
or in the bus conductor who is uh, carrying the tag, they know that uh, this person is coming now and we have an OTP for another additional security. You can give that OTP to that guy, he punches, then it matches and uh, your kit can be uh, picked up by the authorized person in, in your absence and what whom you have authorized and all the records are there in the back end in the system. So you know the best part of the system is any mobile, anybody conversing, you know who sent, what time, where, etc, etc. They are all hosted in uh, uh, cloud, in Azure cloud or Amazon cloud. It's open to say uh, security audits, etc, uh, etc. Et because we don't, like I said, the school smart doesn't use any information for anything. We don't have anything to promote to anybody. Uh, so we uh, we are very, very, uh, if, even if you want, we can host it on your servers. So, and you just have to give us a login whenever it's required for any upgradations and all that stuff. So this is the detail in terms of how it works, how we, we generate a pickup pass uh, instantly and instantly updated with the advance of technology, networks, and all is seamlessly possible. Now we said we want to also make the route journey uh, optimized. This is just again a simple uh, uh, you know, bus tracking solution uh, which we, your route can be optimized. So your fleet management tools are already inbuilt. They are part of the solution. There is nothing which is uh, we do not want to brag about anything on uh, uh, vehicle tracking because vehicle tracking is a very age old 10 year solution. So we, all these are inbuilt. It comes as part of the uh, uh, solution actually. So we can optimize your routes, you can transport, things can be efficient in terms of maybe if you have 70 buses by using our tool and uh, you might reduce the buses by maybe a 3 or 4 depending upon because we map everybody uh, on the uh, map and we know uh, and the capacity we know and we will assign uh, who should be picked up depending upon uh, uh, the students locations etc. Et That's a route optimization uh, uh, tool I said. Then one of the important things we also feel is, it's not important only to uh, track the uh, students. Uh, security means it's much more than uh, just about the student. Who are the people who are visiting your campus? Do you have any record of them? Uh, do you know who are the parents who are visiting at what time, when, six months back, who was visited? Who are the people who are coming to the campus? All this you should have. Now what you have is a manual register, somebody enters, somebody writes, etc, etc. All can be digitized. It is just that, you know, uh, the moment the kid, a visitor comes, we can take a snap and we can store it. You have it. all can see whatever I'm doing. We can pull out all kinds of reports for you. Who are the visitors? Who are the uh, parents who have come? When they have come? When they have left? Even if you say, we also have uh, uh, we have developed something for one good school uh, which says that it, I also want to know how much time uh, if their visitor stays for more than an hour. I want an alert to the administration fetch for that visitor. We can do that. If anybody, because we have locked the entry time and he has not exited from any gate, we can cover all the gates, the gates which you uh, want, etc., etc. We can say, okay, this person has spent one hour, just look at what happened. He is supposed to meet somebody and go. So, this is also, so what all uh, we are trying to do is, we are trying to see what all we can do to enable safety and security of the school. So, you have to secure campus also for uh, securing uh, the children. So this is a very simple topic, but uh, you will find in the nature of implementation there are a lot of hurdles, people are not so amenable to change or they think oh, system chal rahe to chalne do abhi kya hai. So what I, my uh, passion about it is that you know, if you can just think about it, spend some time about it, you really want to uh, give that importance, what you talk, can you do about it, that's how the uh, job done. So these are various methods in terms of how you can uh, have. So so these are uh, these are the various solutions we have, and uh, also I have a couple of more solutions which we are even more to improve than this we are doing because we are taking it upon us that you know this is a journey we will do, and I'm quite uh, passionate about it. And we have got technologists with us, uh, people who have spent at least 20 with a lot of good companies and you know uh, they understand technology and they have uh, engineered uh, these uh, solutions. Okay, now, uh, okay fine, I have come to this stage after doing a lot of uh, work in terms of convincing schools and who are our customers? Our customers are like DPS RK Puram, DPS Society Schools, Newtown School Calcutta. All these schools, uh, they have taken the solution just not like that. They just they don't even allow us to enter the uh, uh, campus if we say we are also a They have discerning IT people, discerning principals, discerning security advisors who, who, who can sift through uh, and then they take the solution. That's why we are very proud to say and all I just 
uh, I, mera koi jugaad nahi hai Delhi mein. I come from Bangalore and I'm proud to say this because all of them have taken this solution just based on merit, what they think that you know it suits them and it's they want to take a step forward in in this journey and they've taken it. So 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 uh, that's the how the whole thing. We got a lot of uh, testimonials uh, uh, and etc etc. So so. So, so many schools, I just, I just want to, want to uh, read uh, this. Okay, so what is, again, to summarize, uh, what I want is make child safety a priority. Watch your talk, walk the talk, okay. And safety is not expensive. What I want to say is we are not expensive because we are the designers of the hardware, designers of the application. I am not a software company trying to buy hardware from XYZ and trying to manage the cost. We are not dealer, distributor, or etc. etc. I own it end to end. It's not, the cost of not having is, expensive if i want to say it costs less than half a pizza for a month for a student if that is what if anybody is thinking what does it cost okay it doesn't cost more than that for a single kit and for the family pizza it's as cheap as that as reasonable as that okay and uh, and we continue to uh, to innovate so i think uh, i know at tech last time we went and i think i went rago sometime in bangalore and we have come, sir, we have come a long way since that time to here. So we are continuously innovating uh, in the, this journey. Uh, so stand up for child safety and join the school's fund movement. All I request is uh, uh, we have a stall here. I can handle all the questions. And like I said, we have competence in this, technological competence. You tap me, you will get a lot of information which I want to share willingly. And second thing is, if you can give us time for the people who come on, our people try to reach you, just give them the time, spend that 15 minutes, half an hour, and if you think that it applies to you, you decide. But uh, my biggest challenge is reaching the management, reaching the decision makers, because you can't leave the safety security as that, okay, you go and meet the transport guy. Transport guy is worried about the transport. He doesn't have a vision of the school. He doesn't have a vision of the security, vision of the ethos of the school. You say you can go and give it to the reception or a mail based on info at da 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 So what I'm saying is, if you can let us speak to you, give us some time, I think you we want to educate and you can take a call. We are not here. I'm not here to hard sell this fact. I just want to see that there are solutions how we can enable as a technology.